All right, everyone. Welcome back to another episode of No Man's Sky. This is the Utopia Expedition, and we're going to do Phase 3 right now. So, let's get things started. Cue up to music, and we will rock and roll. Alright, so what do we got? We got to go to Outpost Gamma, which is on the next planet. While we're there, we're going to collect instructions, build a third base, acquire an exosuit or exocraft upgrade, three aquatic creatures, three living pearls, prepare cocoa and pilgrim's tonic. Both of those are pretty easy to make, if I remember correctly. And document plant life on the third planet, eight plants. So we'll get on that as soon as we get there. Let's see if this baby can fly. Womp, womp, womp. Alright, we do have some fuel. Oh good, it fills it to 100%. That's right, that changed recently. It's the warp that doesn't fill all the way up. Alright, so this is a pretty relaxed mission, I think. At least it feels that way to me. Compared to some of those other ones we had on the Redux missions, they were some of them were a little challenging, like that Leviathan one especially. That was the one, I think, where you kept dying, or you had to die a couple times and stuff. It was the permadeath, and oh man, that was a pain in the ass. So this is a relief and a welcome change. I'll tell you that. But we'll see, uh, we'll see what's happening here. When we get to this planet, hopefully we'll find the... Uh, Rendezvous spot, outpost gamma. Fairly easily, if it's another one of those big places, it won't be hard to find. Let me know down in the comments what you think of this uh, mission so far. Have you beaten it? I'm on my third episode. I'm about an hour and a half into it, roughly, I think. I'm taking about 40 minutes or so. You know, there's a little extra time in there for goofing around while filming and stuff, but for the most part, it's pretty quick. Now, this is going to be a good planet. It's a bountiful planet, but it's got aggressive sentinels, so we're going to have to watch ourselves here. That's going to be a problem. You're really not equipped to fight off sentinels right now, but I think we're about to get a prize, if I remember correctly, from one of these things that will help us out with that. That's the uh, trusty pulse spinner. Look at how much a damn, uh, what do you call it, something cost here, a uh, computer, base computer. Look at that, there it is. Easy peasy. Alright, so yeah, let's take a look at what a computer is going to cost us. 200 chromatic metal and 500 pure ferrite. We got plenty of pure ferrite. We'll have to go get some copper. Or we might even be able to buy some while we're here. I don't know. We'll have to look. Um, can we even afford it? Oh, we got jack for money. <laughs> Never mind. All right, we'll get our first planetary or archive on this planet. Log in. Bingo, bingo, bingo. And we got a supply drop. Which is where? Did not register yet? There we go. Bing bong. Sorry, the princess is on another planet. Ha ha. That's funny. Alright, so new reward available. Let's go get our reward. Supply drop gamma, 1200 nanites, and yep, there's the pulse spitter unit. I hope you have a weapon. Well, guess what? We do now. 
let's see. We're going to move this to here. Move that to there, move that to there, and we will install it right here. Ugh, we can't make it. S sucks. That really sucks. Alright, collect your next. We did that, didn't we? Here it is. Okay. Open the package. And... Token Foundation Settlement Chart. Let's go for it. So how far do we have to go for that? 17 hours. Finium, copper. We're gonna grab that copper while we're here. Ooh, it's a ways down there, but is that it? That's it. Yeah, we're gonna grab it while we're here. Get it processing while we make our way over to that new spot. This is quite the drop here. Oof. All right, Darth Maul was here. Sure made it down there fast. Hey, check out that strider up there. Those things are cool. We got the terrain manipulator, not a lot of copper. Look those deep though. It goes way down. Got the good old silicon powder. We're just going to gather as much of this stuff as we can. Well, feels like we pretty much got it all. Um, still 17 hours away. Let's go ahead and pop this into our little refiner. Not going to give us a lot. 110 plus 66, that's not enough. Any more copper around? Gravitino ball, that'll cause some trouble. Uh, that's the one we just did. Never mind. And yeah, we got worms, cool. Oh, here's some more. That's a long ways away. Alright, well, maybe we'll find some near where we're going. So we'll try that out at least. Oh, here we go. Here's another copper deposit. Never mind. Grab a word while we're here, just because. Alright, let's do this. We really should start scanning plants while we're here, too. Come across any we will. None of these are really big deposits. At least we're getting something out of it. 157, drop it in there. And what do we need? Eight plants, I think? again. Get to our ship. Ugh. And move on. This is not the way. There's the way. Oh, 
I love these places. They're so cool looking. All right, so... Three hours, or two hours. Well, we all know how to fix that, don't we? We got a restoration zone. to keep this safe because these planets are going to have lots of uh, people built on them. I know I'm playing single player right now. I do that for video purposes. It's just a lot easier to do it that way. Um, it might be cool because there'd be a lot of people on these planets, you know, just hanging out and living. Let's see what this is over here. Is this the personal restoration zone? Could be. Maybe. Oh, there's a drop pod there. Don't think that's it. Do another scan real quick just to see what's around. Ain't really nothing, huh? Alright, let's pop a landing. We'll scan some plants, get that done at least. We search for the place we need to find. I think I hear a. Damn it, I do. Warning. Go away. Ah. Alright, we gotta go this way. We're gonna try to run from them. Usually not that hard to do. Yeah, I see. That is a drop pod, but I don't want to waste the resources on it right now, so we were good not to land there because that's not the place. Bye, Sentinels. We'll see you later. Utopia Station, huh? Oh, that's mine. Thought so. Up here now, okay. See how weird it is? You feel like you're going in the right direction and then it just kind of throws you off a little bit. 220. Let's go. Whoa. There's some plant life down here. Alright, let's keep running. Nothing to see here, buddy. I feel like I'm back in the spot I was before. Oh, okay, this is the area. And again, that's a drop pod. Alright, well. Cool enough. Got that. Nothing there. Uh, we'll scan some plants. some underwater ones, but we found the third construction zone, so life is good. Let's go ahead and empty this out. I thought it was still going on. I forgot. You gotta restart it when you add to it. Good. Computer, two oh, hundred and five hundred. Wasn't exactly where I wanted it, but I can live with that. Morning. Yep, this one's ours. And of course, just at the right time.
Can I hide from them inside the drop pod, I wonder? That'd be kind of funny if you can. Let's try it out. Ha! Huh. They're searching. Alright, in the meantime... Uh, Starship's out of range, that's right. Dual chrome fireworks, that's kind of neat. Oh, the pulse spitter is pre-packaged. That's fantastic. Well, that's going to be a nice little weapon to play around with here. Alright, so we're going to need to build a base, I believe, right? But first, we will collect this. Old canvas, golden gag, okay, drone alert. Some of those are new, I think. Could be wrong. Yeah, it wants us to build a base. So, we'll pop out the building camera. Wow. arch. Boom. And then the roof. Why do I keep doing that? That base is done. Now we need to upload it. I know we're building the most ghetto basic bases, but, you know, that's all you need. That's all you need, right? Why spend the time and resources to do more unless you're planning on keeping the uh, thing? And I honestly don't know if I'm going to keep this save or not. Boom, three's done. Alright, so we got the... new uh, construction part, which is in here. Uh, it's this one, right? Portable Exocraft Research Station. I believe that's what we need. Build some technology here. We'll just get this. Perfect. anywhere around. Let's grab this oxygen that I just saw. Here it is. Doesn't want to register? Oh, there we go. And we'll take you guys out too while we're at it. extra oxygen always comes in handy. I guess, yeah, we've got a little carbon here. A little bit more. Flowing. I'm feeling we're going to be building bases, if I remember right, on every planet, so 
That's going to make things interesting. There's going to be a lot of ghetto-ass bases on these planets, unless they reset them after the expedition's over, which they might do. I don't know. And I think we're just going to need to bring our ship in. I don't want to do that, but... Probably the only way we're going to be able to go find ourselves the ocean. 53%. Huh? Well, we do have a lot of dihydrogen, so I'm not too concerned. Just in time for the superheated rainstorm. The ship handles so poorly, man. Oh, I can't even stand it. All right, let's find some ocean. It looked like there was a lot from outer space. Now we got a storm. It's gonna make things real sucky looking. Yeah, that's just great. And that's a big wall. Whoa. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, those are clouds. <laughs> I thought we found some islands on an ocean there. Damn it. Let's keep moving. You know what? I'm going out to space a little bit and we'll get a better look at the planet from here because it looked like they were kind of the ocean was kind of stuck on one part of the planet as opposed to a bunch of smaller ones all over the place the cloud coverage just sucks there's some water right that's water or is that an illusion Nope, that's some a little bit of water. Not nearly enough though. Or is it? Wait a minute, we could be onto something here. Yeah. Definitely be onto something. Perfect. Alright, we're gonna land. Nineteen percent, huh? So we want some fuel. We're gonna need one metal plating for that. Ah oh no. All right, well, I see some pearls already. I'm not going to worry about the drones too much. We'll scan some of these plants, though. down here because I saw a bunch of them. So here's one. So we will get our pulse spitter out. Grab that pearl and roll. Some animals, though. There we go. There's one. Grab a 
us another or another pearl. Yeah, I thought there was one more right around here somewhere. Go away, Sentinel. Oh, there's another animal. Another pearl. These guys are kind of cool looking. The third type? No. Right, we're getting closer to the pearl. Or did we miss it? Looks like we're gonna have to go diving. Pearl diving, as they say. This is cool. What the hell just happened? Oh, well, that's kind of bs -y. Okay. Here, oh, here's the third animal. Right, at least we got that done. Alright, here's some more clams. 228, 228. Yeah, they're like underneath me. I don't want to go under. If it's just going to kick me to the surface, forget it. Let's go ahead and get this and get back to our ship. Oh, see? Look at that. It's underground. What the hell? Alright, well, we'll try this again. drowning down here. But we're really not going that far, so we should be alright. Alright. Let's clear around it a little bit better than we did last time. Go to our pulse spitter. Grab the pearl. Alright, now we get the hell out. too far away. I really hope we can launch this ship. I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> Me alone. Alright, leave me alone, dude. Stay kind of close by here. Yeah, we've already seen that one. We've seen that one. All right, no other underwater plants in the immediate area. That damn sentinel is staying so close by. Here's a plant. And there's a sentinel. Alright, well, let's see if we can launch this puppy. Screw it. Oh, 
Oh, good. All right. Go ahead back to our base. Not too far away. At least if we get there, we can just run inside and duck out from these guys, and we'll take stock of uh, everything, see where we are. I think that's about it for this uh, phase. I think this phase is going to be about done. We'll have to see. Leave me alone. I have this super solid base here. You guys will not be able to get me in here. Oh, I'm not going to be able to land, am I? All right, well, let's, let's fight him. We are going to be inside, baby. You guys can go to hell. Alright. Let's take a look at what we got here. So we... Boom. We did that. We collect a reward here. Oh, we got to make the cocoa and all that. Okay. Site of phosphate. It's interesting. Uh, boom. Osmotic generator, okay. And uh, storage containers. Green shelter cable pod, all kinds of stuff. Nutrient processor, one hermetic seal and two metal plating. Or three metal plating. One hermetic seal. Get that put down. Alright, let's just let this uh, run its course here real quick and then we'll cook up what we gotta cook up. That was a pretty quick one, two, three though right there, huh? Wow, we got all kinds of crap. So this goes on to uh, ships out of range. Um, I don't think we really have anything for cooking, do we? And these guys are just gonna hang out there. You're dead, bud. Get out of here. All right. Oh, we need to harvest impulse beans. Let's get these guys out of here. Damn it. So we can pop that there. Uh, Prepackaged cloaking device. Uh, amplified cartridges. We'll take it. What else we got? Exocraft boost module, the water protection module, scanner module. We'll take that. Just trying to free up a little bit of space here, right? This can go here. And then we can make a launch fuel. Let's get out of here, man. Ok, 
communication services unavailable. Are we set up on that? Yeah. Prepare cocoa and pilgrim's tonic. Star Bramble. Any impulse beams or any beans? There's one. We're gonna run away from you guys, so you're gonna leave me alone. Woohoo! Keep running, baby. Got him searching. We got five of them there, so now we need star bulbs, and I did see them. Uh, where? Come on, star bulbs. I think we need the uh, glove to pick them, too, if I'm not mistaken. Let's get back up top here. Yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can put on the hazmat glove. Oh, chromatic metal. Come on, man. Right, let me throw that in there. Copper. Paraffinium. Find some closer copper. That'll work. Then we'll worry about the star bolt. That's a nice one there, isn't it? Keep sliding, baby. There is a little... Was that... Yeah. Get a little more sodium because I know we used up a bunch. And I'm not sure if we had enough. So at least grab a little bit here. Ugh, so hard to climb here. Copper. My God. This will get us the last of what we need. Phase three, I hope. Yeah, I believe so. Hope we got enough sodium nitrate. This is a nice haul of copper, though, huh? Look at this thing. A friggin' slab of the stuff. We're going to take that and throw it in there. Let's get it finished off. And now we'll take the copper. 
That'll give us plenty. Where's our house? Our house is... Thanks. Bad timing. Technology Hopefully we'll have enough of those to finish up this thing. That's not my base. Where's my damn base? It's so confusing. Where's my ship? Where's anything? Here's my ship. Okay. Down here? Yeah, we're down there. Oh, we will take the oxygen and the sodium. We'll take a little dust. There we go. about enough of these guys. Oh, we never got the stupid Star Bramble. Alright, well, we can do this. Throw the impulse beams in here. That'll make the cocoa. Take that, pop that out, and we will do the hazmat gloves. Technology installed. And now all we need is the star bramble, right? And I know that was kind of nearby. There it is, 319. Pulpy roots. That's not what we want. We want this. All right, let's go get it. Yeah, it won't take long. We're right here. A little sodium while we're at it too. I need a star bramble. Lots of creatures, huh? Why is it telling me to get impulse beams again? Don't I have the cocoa? I have the cocoa. Um, repair cocoa and pilgrim's tonic. Okay. I think that was just like a little error there. Holy crap, you scared me. Alright, let's rock and roll and get the hell out of here because we're done. This phase is pretty much in the back. But I do want to throw some stuff on the ship while we're next to it. Yeah, alright, piss off. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, these guys are annoying as hell. Alright, boom, we're done. Got that. Starbolt. 
token berry. What does it want us to do? Impulse beans again. We don't need to do that. We have enough cocoa, I think. Maybe it wanted us to gather everything all at once, and then... Then do it. Is Pilgrim's Tonic? Yes, it is. Alright, travelers, well... This is about the end of this one, I think. Oh, we never built our little Gek statue, did we? Our little holographic Gek. I have to do that. Did that do it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on? We've got... Pilgrim's Tonic. I got Bittersweet Cocoa. Oh, I think it's just taking a bit. No? Just to do more freaking impulse beams? Come on. Star Bramble. Uh -huh. Well, that's aggravating. Seriously aggravating. What the hell's going on? Pulpy friggin' roots. We're gonna head over toward the pulpy roots. Yeah, yeah, go away, Sentinel Drones. Sometimes you get more than one plant next to each other and one of them hides the other one, kinda. Oh, there we go, impulse beans. <sighs> We're going for it. In the storm, but we got a little heat protection now, which is good from one of those uh, one of those things we got as a reward. So that's cool. You better give me three. All right, give me six. All right, I guess I had to prepare them both at the same time. Oh, all right, don't make that mistake, guys made this a little tougher than it had to be. Running around in a crappy storm. Sentinels harassing my every move. Picking beans. And Star Bramble. Not fun. Looks like I get a little more gusto out of the jetpack right now. go. And another worm. Alright, prepare Pilgrim's Tonic. Boy, am I glad I didn't use all the Star Bowl. We'd be looking for that again. Didn't say how many, right? So we'll do we'll do ten of them just to be safe. Uh -huh. 
throw those in there. We'll see what we get out of all this. This should be interesting. This will put us, what, halfway halfway done? Or over halfway? I don't remember how many uh, phases there are. Okay. Cook local dishes. Weird. Yeah, this is over halfway done then. Alright, inventory full. Of course it's full. Of course. But what we can do is this. This is where it gets good. Put that in there, that in there, that in there. That can go in there. We don't need any of that. We'll put that in there for now too. Now, we'll collect our reward. Ooh, five of them. That's kind of awesome. We've got an assortment of cakes too. We're not going to need those, so what we'll do is we'll do this. Back to the ingredients, and boom, 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 boom. Those two look the same. Apple cake of lost souls, itching, creeping honey sponge. Sounds like a stripper name. Gooey screamer, <laughs> that sounds like a porno name, and fluffy throat ripper. <laughs> Oh my, they had fun naming those. Okay. And phase three award is the Fearsome Visor Customization. Ooh, that's going to be badass. So yeah, let's take a look and see. Where's our buddy, our little guy we can build? Is he in here? No, is he in here? There he is, the holographic friend. And we need Geknip, of course. Gah! All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of No Man's Sky. This is the Utopia Expedition. This has been Phase 3 from start to finish. Thanks for joining me. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Ring that bell for notifications to do these videos daily, and you don't want to miss them. I will see you all next time. Until then, peace.